I want you to subscribe, share, and like this video. Thank you. Hi, uh, so my name is Kibrace, and this is another episode of Somewhere in Ghana. And on this episode, let's talk about this thing that has happened at Mankasim. You know, wake up to a very, very, very sad news, shall we? Hmm. So, a pastor has been arrested in aiding a chief to kill a young, beautiful girl who went for what, an interview. And, you know, I don't know why, Charlie, people are so wicked. Bro, you know, people are wicked to understand that they don't even care what's going to happen before they do something to you because of their, their own personal interest. Look at this, a pastor, a chief, kill, and you know the saddest thing, bro, they buried the girl in one of the, the, the chief's words, room. Hey! You know, I was not surprised when I heard it was a pastor and was a chief. Bro, rituals. Because according to the story, it was all about rituals. Because if not that, why would a pastor aid or a chief? You know, them supposed to be arrested, them for, no, them for lash them first before they take and go out prison. And the funny thing in Ghana, be say they go give them out lawyers, then they go go, they go, go court, oh, tomorrow we go, this will not be court and everything at all. Lash them, they will take them, take them go out prison straight. Because this was wickedness. Somebody came for an interview and she ended up losing a life. Come on. So according to the story, this lady wanted to enter into nursing training. So she was invited to come for interview at Mankasim in the central region. The parents were so happy for her, so they escorted her to go. Before she left, her other sister gave her her boyfriend's contact number so she can meet him, saying this little sister don't know Mankasim very well. When this lady finished the interview, she called her sister's boyfriend for a visit. So the man told her to wait at a place so he can take her home. So the lady asked one of the male friends in the college to show her the place to meet the man. While they were waiting, a red taxi arrived. Arrived and the man got down and picked the lady off. The man who is a pastor came with a friend who is one of the sub-chiefs in the Mankasim. They sent the lady to this house and killed her. They buried her in this room. <laughs> Buried somebody in a room. Let me continue. While she was not returning home for a long time, the family started calling her number, but it was off. After a week, one of the family members posted it on Facebook. So they said, good. Luckily, the young boy who was with her before the taxi took her also replied that the lady told her that she wants to visit her elder sister's boyfriend. Through this information, that they managed to apprehend the suspect and find her dead body. Look at this. Look at how somebody, an innocent girl, came for an interview and ended up losing her life. Such was a wicked world, a cold world world. You know what I mean? I say, make them not take them go courts and they could be some question. They are telling, lash them. Send them to prison straight. Yes. I don't say it not be so, they do them, but we don't call them Because, bro, this is sad. This is very what, sad. So um, it's, it's fine that they've what, arrested a pastor, but according to the story, they are here to what, arrest the chief. They are supposed to make sure that they arrest that chief. That chief way they do this thing. Make the arrest them. So this is the pastor. Welcome to Casa Sarah Mati. Now they tell you can't show me Now I can be there to listen. Oh, but Mama, my sister, I didn't see you say. I can't do that no more. I wish I was here. I'm 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 just look at him. Look at what he they say, say, Hank of Nimia. Hey, <laughs> like me, they will go slap and he go see something. How can he be so wicked and come back and say, Hank of Nimia? 
Charlie, this thing is happening for Ghana, bro. Because in two hours, all the Americans will nyash nyash. Because right now, I don't know how the parents are what receiving this. You go there, how they they call you? So, oh, um, your your daughter is sold dead. Come on, bro. And you know, I was really happy when one of the residents said this in a video. Can you see CCTV? My kesim ha, e jama duwe all kaso hapa. E yes a hampoko. Oh man, we mu all kaso. You all mu we sika no. Masa we di bani ya. We mu di sika. I we I we we. I can hear me just here ya. Masa we fa escalator. We mu do jalo ru. Like what I was saying, it is happening in Ghana. What's he say? This will be the first time we hear this all. And I don't know why people want to do this. Like if not be money ritual, they be bill. They even build later. You go here, so the pastor he build big church, he they buy cars, they live like just life. I'm not saying that Ghanaian pastor they do some, but hey, it is weird and was strange to hear say if the pastor then chief will do this, then it's supposed to it's supposed to tell you something for real. So, I me, mean, what are they saying? We say make them lash them if possible, then or they will take them go court or maybe prison. Yes, when yeah, and now your best man will be lawyer, be any. There be, and sometimes in, in Ghana, they decide that stuff will happen like this. Oh, but say, uh, I shall say, nah, tell you good day, but later, and you don't go hear anything. But say, I say, about to go, then another one will happen. It's about time I will take matters serious in this country because this is something that we should be tolerate. The saddest thing you bury them for what you, hey, my goodness, you know, they are supposed to do them something, actually. Somebody out there would even try to do some. Yes, because bro, this thing they happen. It not be today where you start. What's he say? Because we don't do them anything. We should. I say, everybody say now attention. Oh, oh, say say say. But later, no, you don't go hear anything. And so people are willing to do it. And every day, you know, they will they will take people's life. You know, some people's sort of lives. They are supposed to do them. Like I don't know how they go feel do bad. But don't know. Do as oh as a court and then then then. I bet no. That's a very normal. Charlie, do I make them change them the process? Lash and lash them, do them something actually. Or be crowd about thing and also be people so if you want yet. Okay, I'll end. Honestly, this is very sad. Me after watching the video, how they were a very sad. So please make words be safe. Let's take off ourselves out there because the world is not what's safe. Yes, you can lose your life at any point in what in time for real. Right. So this is what happened at Mankesim in the central region of Ghana. It's a sad news and I know you're going to learn something from this. Bro, or sister, because they say, you know, because of money, because of everything, so people are willing to do anything. I sign out. Thank you for watching this. I'll be back again with another video. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I want you to subscribe, share, like, and leave a comment in the section below. Thank you.